Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Marlon O'Bennett. Hopefully you guys are tuned in and ready for today's lesson, guys. We're going to talk about some really cool stuff. Sometimes though, guys, what I like to do to get your mind working a little bit is I like to kind of give you guys a little brain teasers, right? So today, you know, I'm going to start this off a little bit different. And I'm going to ask you guys a question with a little brain teaser and see if you guys can figure out the answer to it. Here we go. Though brothers and sisters, I have none, this man's father is my father's son. I'll say it again. Though brothers and sisters, I have none. This man's father is my father's son. And to wrap it up a little bit, whoever can answer that, the first person who emailed me, I'm going to ask you guys to email me. You answer me with the right answer. If you got a PayPal account, I'll actually pay you $5. Is that cool or what? So I'll let you know what the answer is at the end of this video, but just think about that for a second. Today, guys, what I want to talk about is interacting with your list, right, and building rapport and uh, establishing relationships with your list. And we've already covered all kinds of great information, right, in terms of, you know, uh, list building, capture pages, and setting up campaigns and, and funnels, what I like to call profit funnels, right, and, you know, through autoresponders. We already talked about all that things. And I asked you guys at the last, the last video, I said, now all you got to do is figure out what it is you want to market. Because you basically know how to set up a campaign and a profit funnel. You know, we covered all those things. So you should be excited. But one of the things I wanted to talk about in terms of, of, of building your list and one of the ways you can, you know, create even more or profit as you start going, you know what I mean, throughout this, this process is, is through establishing rapport and relationships with that list that you're now starting to build, right? And so that's going to be very, very important. And I think, to me, one of the most important things that you can do when you do that is providing people or your list with unique content and value. You know what I mean? I'm talking about information uh, that's going to get them a little bit closer to where it is they want to be, right? I, I hope that makes sense to you guys. I like to think of it as do, learn, and teach. And, and what I mean by that is, you, you'll become a problem solver. You know what I'm saying? When you learn how to solve people's problems, right, with solutions that they're having, and you learn how to relay that, right, through, 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 I mean, there are different ways you can do it. But when you learn how to, you know, show people how to get a little bit closer, you know, I mean, do, with do, doing, learning, and teaching, and becoming a problem solver, and, and you find the solutions to these, the problems these employees are having, right, you're going to become an asset to them, right? And, and you do this by whatever you, with stuff that you've learned. You know what I mean? Anything you learn, you can do it through uh, uh, videos, through whiteboard presentations, through screen capture. And, and don't worry about being perfect. Just, just, just whatever you learn, right, learn to share it with other people to, that way. And now you're providing them with, 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 with content of value. And, and oftentimes, hopefully, these people are going to be looking forward to the next email that you send because you provided them with, with some real value. So that's how you start uh, uh, building rapport with your listeners and establishing relationships with them. And again, you don't got to be perfect. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I remember my first video. <laughs> wow. And even now, you know what I mean? I, I, I look at some of my videos and I'm like, wow, I messed up. And I'm going to go right back and redo it. My wife said, no, don't redo it. Just, you know, that's what it is. Now, you still want to keep personal development, development in mind. You want to get better at your craft. You want to, quote unquote, like I say often become as you become a student of the game you'll just you just going to your personal development will just escalate over time you know what I mean so so keeping all that stuff in mind right keeping all those things in mind you just start to share this content through your emails uh if you guys still on my list you're gonna see a lot of mindset training okay because I would say 50% of internet marketing it's about mindset. You know what I mean? It truly is. But as you get comfortable with yourself and you get comfortable with as you do and you learn and you go out and start teaching, you're just going to get more comfortable with it. And you're going to, it'll make you, it, you, you, you'll understand that as people continue to see this kind of content. And then a lot of these people are going to get, they're going to get to know you. They're going to get to, to like you and they're going to start to, to trust you and ultimately you can move a lot more product and service right and even build a team if you want which we'll be talking about in later in a, in a, in a video later on um, by doing this okay because because people are more apt to do business with people that they know they like or they trust 
all three or any combination of those. So keeping that in mind, as you go out here and you start building uh, these profit funnels, uh, make sure you're creating valuable content. I gave you uh, guys an example in the last video, um, and now uh, you know, you know what I mean? And we'll later on, as a matter of fact, we'll talk about swipe copy, you know, how to get... Uh, the, the, these emails open with with, by, with, with, with with exotic and tantalizing titles, okay? Because that's, you know, we, we'll, we'll, we'll cover that later. Anyway, that's all I wanted to pass on to you guys today. Uh, oh, and for the answer to the brain teaser, I said, the brothers and sisters I have done, this man's father is my father's son. Did anybody figure it out? Hands, hands, anybody? Okay, the answer to that, guys, is me. Though this man's father is my father's son, no, though brothers and sisters, I have none, this man's father is my father's son. It's me. So for all you real sharp, really sharp-minded guys, you old ladies, you guys already probably figured it out. I think it's pretty cool. So anyway, if you guys want the five bucks, hey, that's a, 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 a coffee at Starbucks. No, no, I'm sorry. No, it's not. Starbucks coffee way more. But it's a lot of coffee at 7-Eleven. So anyway, you want the $5, email me. Uh, well, actually, I'm telling you the answer. So you can't email me and get the $5. So I messed up. Okay, sorry, guys. Maybe next time I won't tell the answer before you guys get a chance to do that. Anyway, I've gone on long enough. You guys need to keep your eyes open for tomorrow's email. It's a surprise. So look for the surprise email from me tomorrow, and we'll talk about some other cool stuff you can start implementing in your business to get where it is you want to go. As always, this is your boy, Marlon Bennett, wishing you guys wisdom, peace, prosperity, and to living an internet lifestyle without limits. Keep banging.